Oh yes, big, huge tuna, huge tuna. Yeah, yeah. No, no, I'm, I'm not kidding. It's bigger than anything you can catch in this year. Deep drop prep video one. <laughs> we uh, we made a weight, or James made a weight. It's essentially a piece of a fence with some bridling floss. One and a half pounds, and then we have 80 pound monofilament on a clip with three hooks, probably a 10 foot looking rig. We're not doing a Palu bag, but uh, we have this LED light. Oh yeah, there it is, disco in, so. We can connect the circuit with our fingers, but so does the water. Yeah, it's a crazy looking rig. Probably gonna just butterfly some Opelu and put it on there. And half their circle hooks, because at depth we're not gonna be able to um, set the hook, so hopefully whatever eats it just kind of gobbles it. And uh, beautiful looking knots here. Yeah, it's like a giant sabiki meant to plunge to the deep deep i think with two experienced kayak fishermen on one tandem kayak we'll handle it i got a shot we'll try it it's deep drop day i brought my electric reel with me well he's not really electric but uh he runs on mayonnaise and monster energy drinks so <laughs> i guess it's the same idea either way i don't have to reel i'm in charge of boat positioning who knows? He also exploded his drive, so he's desperate. We have one bait so far. We uh, were late to the gun because we forgot our... We butterflied a bunch of Opelu earlier <laughs> yesterday. And we forgot them. So I had to go back and get them. And then got stuck behind a school bus. <laughs> so it took a while. <laughs> we were just going to be like, Alright, electric reel start cranking. Hopefully your biceps are ready for this. Cause we gotta make it, we gotta make it worth it. We gotta drop a few times. It's cool. Oh, birds. Oh, oh. That's legit. Let's go, let's go. Good spot on the birds. I didn't see that. I looked off to the left and I saw a pile. How to bring in. Yes, yeah. Really? Depends on how long it's been in the water. Should I go up to it to get a seat? Yeah, we'll pass right by it. It does look pretty fresh, doesn't it? Who knows, it might get bit on the way back in. And you know what, I think it was worth it to try because you just never know. You always have to try and they sometimes will come towards you. Alright, bite up dogs. We're going for the oil fish. <laughs> walla walla. <laughs> walla walla. I got some balloons here. Okay. I got a balloon! Yeah, rig up that deep rod. The birds are nowhere to be seen. Oh. Damn. <laughs> I see why it's. <laughs> <laughs> like it's heavy. <laughs> yeah. I didn't realize. <laughs> oh. yep, it feels Fight like it. He's gonna, he's gonna run. How deep are we? Can I even? Can five, I to do five, that? thirteen. Okay, so I can play it out. Yeah. Cool. There we go. There's a run. I'm surprised we haven't had a fly. There it goes. There it goes. Yep. <laughs> it. Right. it ate the balloon, popped it off. I saw the, the bait on the surface going da 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 da. Oh, this is a big fish, dude. I know. I felt its weight. <laughs> it ate that big bait. This is a really big fish. Yeah. I can, like. You're getting, you're making progress here, though. If the if the button is inside the little click, yeah, that means it's low gear. Okay, so it's not inside. 
when it starts getting shallow there you're gonna pop it back into high gear just in case it does crazy runs but right now you can winch you're making headway right yep cool now you can click it up a tiny bit but not a lot a little bit goes a long way on that rod so careful you're making progress you're now above 250 but luckily we're going out to deeper water so we can play this thing you might want to swap it to the left side here this is this is a bigger than a 40 pound class all right you're, you're about halfway up from 250 so 150. that whale is just going to town over there Connor, i can feel the weight of this fish it's more, big and this is a 50 plus I, I know it's it's kicking like it is i just don't want to get any jinx that whale is just smacking the water with his tail look at him maybe you're hooked up to that whale <laughs> that guy's just whacking it do you see him Crazy. What's happening? Remember how, like, you were making fun of me when I caught that big one by myself in super rough conditions, <laughs> and you're getting your kicked by like I'm thinking probably a similar class fish right now. <laughs> Stop. And you don't even have to steer the boat. And it's dead flat out here. Didn't help that the fact that you've been cranking on the deep drop front. <laughs> Uh, like the fish wait for you to be nice and uh, sore. Good God, this thing is a monster, dude. <laughs> this is why we have the Talica. All right, keep fighting it. I say deep, 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 deep color, and it looks like a big tuna at that, like big tuna. Oh yes, big, huge tuna, huge tuna. You can see it. Yep. Just say big. No, no, I'm, I'm not kidding. It's bigger than anything we've been catching this year. Just in case. Down the uh, yeah. strike or keep it? Uh, down the strike. Uh, no, keep it, keep it, keep it. Okay. So when he does that circle, yeah, you don't. You want to gain right now. You want to gain right now, and then you want to. All right. And once he turns his head this way, slow down and let him go underneath the kayak, and then you want to gain. Yep. Rot tip down. Rot tip down a little bit. Yep. And swing underneath. All right. Once you get him on the surface level and you swing him back my way with his head, I'll go for the kill shot. Alright, down, down, down. Alright, this one's the kill shot. Nope. Opening drag? Not opening, but... Holy it's not the biggest ever, but it's a big boy. I think my summertime one is bigger. Oh. I don't know. No, I know this one. I know, but still. Comparable. I wouldn't say it's that compared. Oh my God, dude. I just shook the hook out. Here, I'm going to lay him down. Alrighty there. Mahalo. <laughs> All right, oh, oh, on. get your phone out. Yeah. You know how your fingers get weird? I'm gonna try to turn this tuna around, is that alright? You turn and slide back in there like that. Alright. Alright, Finn. Go back down. A little flubby boy. She be. I think it's 50. Uh, yeah. Oh. It's definitely 40 to 50. Yeah, I think it's approach. I bet you it's a 48. 
That's what my guess That's, is. Remember what I said? It was like just short of 50. I said that on the water. Mm. It's close. It's 40s to 50s for sure, though. Definitely upper 40s. That's like 23 kilograms. Oh, yeah. What do we got? 51 pounds. Woo! Yeah. 51, 51. pounds, Shibi. 51 pounds. 